Hibernate is one of the most widely used ORM tools for building Java applications. It is used in enterprise applications for database operations. So, this video on Hibernate interview questions will help you to brush up your knowledge before the interview. If you are a fresher or inexperienced, this is the right platform for you which will help you to start your preparation for the Hibernate job roles. In this video, I list top 20 Hibernate interview questions with answers with proper examples. To start Hibernate interview questions and answers session, I request you to subscribe to my YouTube channel and press bell icon to get real-time updates of interview questions and answers, which is helping to prepare the interview. What is Hibernate? Hibernate is one of the most popular Java frameworks that simplify the development of Java application to interact with the database. It is an object relational mapping ORM, tool. Hibernate also provides a reference implementation of Java API. It is referred as a framework which comes with an abstraction layer and also handles the implementations internally. The implementations include tasks like writing a query for CRUD operations or establishing a connection with the databases, etc. Hibernate develops persistence logic, which stores and processes the data for longer use. It is a lightweight tool and most importantly open sourced which gives it an edge over other frameworks. What are the major advantages of Hibernate Framework? There are five major advantages of Hibernate. First is, it is open sourced and lightweight. Second is, performance of Hibernate is very fast. Third is, helps in generating database independent queries. Fourth is, provides facilities to automatically create a table. And fifth is, it provides query statistics and database status. What is an ORM tool? It is basically a technique that maps the object that is stored in the database. An ORM tool helps in simplifying data creation, manipulation, and access. It internally uses the Java API to interact with the databases. Why use Hibernate Framework? Hibernate overcomes the shortcomings of other technologies like JDBC. First is, it overcomes the database dependency faced in the JDBC. Second is, changing of the databases cost a lot working on JDBC, Hibernate overcomes this problem with flying colors. Third is, code portability is not an option while working on JDBC. This is easily handled by Hibernate. Fourth is, Hibernate strengthens the object level relationship. Fifth is, it overcomes the exception handling part which is mandatory while working on JDBC. And last is, it reduces the length of code with increased readability by overcoming the boilerplate problem. What are the technologies that are supported by Hibernate? Hibernate supports a variety of technologies, like, Zdiklet Spring, Maven, Eclipse Plugins, and J2E. What is HQL? HQL is the acronym of Hibernate Query Language. It is an object-oriented query language and is independent of the database. How to achieve mapping in Hibernate? Association mappings are one of the key features of Hibernate. It supports the same associations as the relational database model. Three association mappings. First is, one-to-one -one associations. Second is, many-to-one associations. And last is, many-to-many -many associations. You can map each of them as a uni or bi-directional association. Name some of the important interfaces of Hibernate Framework. There are three Hibernate interfaces. First is, Session Factory, org.hibernate.session factory, second is, Session, org.hibernate.session, and third is, Transaction, org.hibernate.transaction. What is one-to-one -one association in Hibernate? In this type of mapping, you only need to model the system for the entity for which you want to navigate the relationship in your query or domain model. You need an entity attribute that represents the association, so annotate it with an at at one to one annotation. What is one to many association in Hibernate? In this type of association, one object can be associated with multiple slash different objects. Talking about the mapping, the one to many mapping is implemented using a set Java collection that does not have any redundant element. 
This one to many element of the set indicates the relation of one object to multiple objects. What is many to many association in Hibernate? Many to many mapping requires an entity attribute and a at many to many annotation. It can either be unidirectional and bidirectional. In unidirectional, the attributes model the association and you can use it to navigate it in your domain model or JPQL queries. The annotation tells Hibernate to map a many to many association. The bidirectional relationship mapping allows you to navigate the association in both directions. How to integrate Hibernate and Spring? Spring is also one of the most commonly used Java frameworks in the market today. Spring is a Java EE framework and Hibernate is the most popular ORM framework. This is why Spring Hibernate combination is used in a lot of enterprise applications. Following are the steps you should follow to integrate Spring and Hibernate. Add Hibernate Entity Manager, Hibernate Core and Spring ORM dependencies. Create model classes and corresponding DAO implementations for database operations. The DAO classes will use session factory that will be injected by the Spring Bean configuration. Note that you don't need to use Hibernate Transaction Management, as you can leave it to the Spring Declarative Transaction Management using at Transactional Annotation. What is Session in Hibernate and how to get it? Hibernate Session is the interface between Java Application Layer and Hibernate. It is used to get a physical connection with the database. The session object created is lightweight and designed to be instantiated each time an interaction is needed with the database. This session provides methods to create, read, update and delete operations for a constant object. To get the session, you can execute HQL queries, SQL native queries using the session object. What is Hibernate Session Factory? Session Factory is the factory class that is used to get the session objects. The session factory is a heavyweight object so usually, it is created during application startup and kept for later use. This session factory is a thread safe object which is used by all the threads of an application. If you are using multiple databases then you would have to create multiple session factory objects. Discuss the collections in Hibernate. Hibernate provides the facility to persist the collections. A collection basically can be a list, set, map. Collection, sorted set, sorted map. Java.util.list, Java.util.set, Java.util.collection, etc., are some of the real interface types to declare the persistent collection value fields. Hibernate injects persistent collections based on the type of interface. The collection instances generally behave like the types of value behavior. What are the collection types in Hibernate? There are five collection types in Hibernate used for one-to-many relationship mappings. Bag, set, list, array, and map. What is a Hibernate template class? When you integrate Spring and Hibernate, Spring ORM provides two helper classes, Hibernate DAO support and Hibernate template. The main reason to use them was to get two things, the session from Hibernate and Spring transaction management. However, from Hibernate 3.0.1, you can use the session factory get current session method to get the current session. The major advantage of using this template class is the exception translation but that can be achieved easily by using at repository annotation with service classes. What is dirty checking in Hibernate? Hibernate incorporates dirty checking feature that permits developers and users to avoid time-consuming write actions. This dirty checking feature changes or updates fields that need to be changed or updated, while keeping the remaining fields untouched and unchanged. What is meant by light object mapping? The means that the syntax is hidden from the business logic using specific design patterns. This is one of the valuable levels of ORM quality and this light object mapping approach can be successful in case of applications where there are very fewer entities or for applications having data models that are metadata driven. What is Query Cache in Hibernate? Hibernate implements a separate cache region for queries result set that integrates with the Hibernate second level cache. This is also an optional feature and requires a few more steps in code. 